Ladies, quick question. If I pull it up in my car to pick up you and my mom, who gets that front seat? You or my mom? Who gets to ride shotgun? You or my mom? Let me know. What's good, everybody? Welcome back to the Lockout Men Podcast Show. Thank you for tuning in right quick. And there you have it. There's the question. This is it. This is what's up. This is the start of a new series that I'm going to be doing in the future as well. So, ladies, let us know who gets the front seat, you or his moms. Ladies, quick question. If I pull it up in my car to pick up you and my mom, who gets that front seat? You or my mom? Zippor, who gets that front if seat? Who, who? If, if, we, if we are married, I do. But if we're not married, I will sit in the back seat. Zippor. One blank period, not even open for discussion. Even open for discussion. That's just how that's gonna be. Ooh. I don't even know why you called me with that. Ooh, you say <laughs> you you say not open for discussion. Nope. Oh, I don't my. even know why you called me with that. Oh my god! Because when you get married, you and your spouse is supposed to become one. God come first. Your spouse come second. Your children come third, and your mama come last. Ooh. Support, bro. What? what? You call me. What? The Bible says, leave your parents and cling to your spouse. It does not say get married and put your wife in the back seat because that's your mama. No, that's not how that works. Support, I've been married before and I ain't never had a problem with my mother in law sitting in the back seat. Mm. And I ain't we never had that problem. Mm. But she automatically knew that she's supposed to sit in the back. Okay, that's what's up. All right, that's that's the poor. We moving on. Ladies, quick question. If I pull it up in my car to pick up you and my mom, who gets that front seat? You Ooh. or my mom? <laughs> Ooh, Kiki? <laughs> Kiki? Oh, 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 oh. Mm, Kiki? <laughs> wait a minute, wait a minute. <laughs> I give it to my I give it to mom. So I give it to mom. You give it to mom. I give it to mom. I you, know mom. That's her baby. Ooh, so you. That's it, her baby. Now let me ask you this: If if now now if you was married, would would you still give it to mom? Yeah, I give it to mom. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, I do that. Yeah, I okay. give it to mom. It's okay. Okay, give it That's to all right. give it to moms, Kiki. All right, moving all right. on. All right, thanks, Kiki. <laughs> Ooh, you, you you coming back with another thought? What's what's up, Kiki? Yeah, you already know. Now, if she disrespectful, that's another. <laughs> if she one of the mothers that you know what I'm saying, mm-hmm. that's just disrespectful all the time. I don't know. <laughs> I have to tell him, look, uh uh-uh. uh, she got a roll. She got a roll in the back seat. Ah, so you say that you know, she... you know, you know, you know, you know how some mothers is. They could be, they could be crazy with they with their daughter in law. You know, it, it. You know what I'm saying? So, so you say, so crazy. you, so you say, if she's not it crazy, is... she get the front seat out of respect. But if she on some disrespectful shit, it's the back seat all the way. Yes, it, it's the back seat. Yep. Oh shit! And he, and he gonna have to wait a minute. He gonna have to let her know. Or uh, I probably won't be on the ride. <laughs> All right. I appreciate it. Thank you, sweetheart. <laughs> All right. Um. Ladies, quick question. If I pull it up in my car to pick up you and my mom, who gets that front seat? You or my mom? Keisha. Your mother. What? Yeah. So so, so you you give up the front seat for the, for, for the mom? Absolutely, I have respect for my elders. All right, so you absolutely, but you're married though, so it don't matter. The, uh, it don't matter. Nope, mom come first. My, oh! <laughs> okay, okay. You, so the, so nope. the moms, mom, right? Mom, mom, gotta get the front seat. You say, yep. you say, mom do. So okay, all right. Oh yeah, mom gotta get the front seat. She older, number one. Why should she have to be in the back? 
with her legs all cramped up and all that. No, she all right. Ooh. Let her go on the front. All right, moving I'll on. I'll be all right. Thanks a lot, Keisha. No problem, bro. Right. Ladies, quick question. If I pull it up in my car to pick up you and my mom, who gets that front seat? You or my mom? Tammy Turner. Your mom. Who get that? What? Your mom. Okay, okay. Now, if y'all, now, is there any difference if y'all was married, though? No. Go ahead. Go I would ahead. do that whether I was married or not to the person because your mom is just, she's an elder. So she gets my respect. You, you, you get the front seat. Ooh, Tammy Turner. Thank you very much. I'm uh, moving <laughs> on. Thank you, Tammy. Okay. You're welcome. Ladies, quick question. If I pull it up in my car to pick up you and my mom, who gets that front seat? You or my mom? Check her chick. Who gets that front? Who gets that front seat? You or the your mom. the mom? Yeah, fuck yeah, the mom does. Why would she not? That's his mom. Ooh, okay, okay. Now you're married, trucker. Why are you gonna disrespect the mom? Ooh, you're, you're... Yeah, my mother in law was the coolest. I had the coolest mother in law in the fucking world. She got the front seat every time. If you don't get along with your mom, mother in law, or you don't, you do get along with your mother in law, give her the front seat. What is it gonna hurt you? Is it gonna kill you? Are you fucking stupid? You, it's gonna fucking kill you to give your mother in law the front seat. You, you're so fucking egotistical. You're so fucking egotistical that your mother in law can't get the front seat. Even if you don't get along with her, what does it matter? It's called respect. Chuck you fucking show her some respect. Maybe she had a hard life, man. Who cares? My mother in law would get the. I fucking lifted my mother in law out of her wheelchair and fucking put her wheelchair in my trunk. To get her in my fucking front seat. Ooh, Who cares? Chick, chick. Yes, yes, yes. Anybody right. who's jealous of anybody's family, okay, especially the mother. My husband's mother died, okay? I would do anything to have that woman alive. Could we have lived together? No. We would not have gotten along together. But I will say one thing. That woman was cool as hell, and as long as we didn't live together, we were best friends. And I will say that's not the case with everybody. I dated people who had really shitty mothers. You know, they acted really like, you know, shitty towards you. But at the same time, that's their mom. They brought them into this world. If they have respect for their mom, then they're going to have respect for another woman. If they're too much of a mama's boy, then don't fucking date them. But if you're going to have respect for them, then let the mom sit in the front seat. What does it matter if they sit in the front seat or the back seat? All right. What does it matter? Do you really, is that, is it really that uncomfortable in the back seat or are you just fucking butt it? Seriously. Ooh, there we go. Chuck That's my that, opinion. Chuck that <laughs> chick. Thank you very much. Moving That's on. That's my opinion. I appreciate you. You're Thank welcome. You. All right. Ladies, quick question. If I pull it up in my car to pick up you and my mom, who gets that front seat? You or my mom? So, B. Janice, who who gets that front seat? You or your or or his mom? His mom gets the front seat. Mm. Why? My mommy gets the front seat because mom was there before me, and depending on how we are in a relationship, if he's my boyfriend, mom might be there after me, and I need to get the respect from mom. So, if we do become husband and wife. I need her to know that I respect her and her position. But until I'm married and with a ring on my finger, mommy comes first. Once I come first and I'm white, then we can discuss it and talk about it. But being humble, I'm probably still going to give her that seat. And if we have that respect, when I'm married, she'll automatically take that back seat and give it back to me. Oh, be Janice, moving on. I did kind of want to see, now that you called me, I am getting ready to go back into being a rough rider. And I wanted to see if maybe I can do a little solicitation and shout out because it's a charity bike and car wash we're doing in Jacksonville, Florida. Okay. So I wanted to see if maybe you put it on the air. Okay. There ain't, there ain't no problem. There ain't no problem. Go, uh, when 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 is this? All right, perfect. So it's the Jacksonville Rough Riders bike, um, bike and Car Wash. It's a charity event. We're doing a bike and car wash on April 2nd, 2022 from 10 a.m. to 3 p.m. We're going to be working with the Longshoremen Association, 1408, ILA 1408, for their college student scholarship. 
Um, it's going to be at 5753 Blanding Boulevard in Jacksonville, Florida, 32244. There's going to be food, a DJ, and games. We're also doing a raffle. We got all kinds of people that supported our raffle from Walmart to Target, TGI Fridays, and Firestone, oil changes going out and everything. So come out. If you're in the area, come out, support us, support Jacksonville, and just say hey. Ladies, quick question. If I pull it up in my car to pick up you and my mom, who gets that front seat? You or my mom? All right, so what's up, what's up? Who gets that front seat? You or his mom? Out of respect, I'm going to ask the mother what she wanted to do. Mm. Period. Mm. Okay. I mean, if the mother wants to send her front, I'm going to respect the mother. Like, that's his mother. Okay, oh, yeah. but what if y'all yeah. mar- what if y'all married though? If we marry, I mean it's not that person. I can I'm humble myself and like let go of my pride. And if his mother wants to sit in the front, it's no big deal. Ooh. It's only a car. Ooh. It's only a car. Ooh, we get, oh, man. I know he loves me, Ooh. and I know you know it's just a respect thing. Ooh, this but is most a, older people want to sit in the back. Ooh, this is fucking awesome. I can't wait till I put this together. Thank you. <laughs> Moving on. You're welcome. Ladies, quick question. If I pull it up in my car to pick up you and my mom, who gets that front seat? You or my mom? Who gets that front seat, honey bunny? Uh, well, I take. <laughs> you, honey bunny, who gets that front seat? You or his mom? It depends on how old she is. <laughs> if she's older, she can definitely get that. Like, if she's an older lady and she needs help or anything like that, like, she can definitely get the front seat. And me, I don't mind sitting in the back. I'll be back there late. Wait, it doesn't really matter to me. Oh, honey, buddy says that you said it's how old she is. Now, what if y'all married, though? It still doesn't matter. I mean, if she needs help or assistance getting in and out, the front seat that is probably able to lift up and down and move forward and backwards for her so she can be comfortable, then she, she can definitely have that. Now, she doesn't need any assistance or anything like that, uh, then she's getting her behind in the back seat while I'm sitting in the front because I don't like sitting in the back seat but because it's not comfortable. Honey, buddy, thank you, ma'am. I'm moving on. Ladies, quick question. If I pull it up in my car to pick up you and my mom, who gets that front seat? You or my mom? Who gets that front seat, Driggly? gonna get it. Who? I'm gonna let his mama gonna get that front seat. You you gonna let that now now why? Why you gonna let the mama get the front seat? Because if he gotta ask that goddamn question, he don't need me sitting by his ass. (laughs) (laughs) Oh my god. Now what if what if what if y'all married though? Still what if y'all married? What you mean, what if we married? What does that mean? <laughs> what if y'all married? What did, does that change? <laughs> you say, what Mama that paying some bills? <laughs> Is Mama paying bills? <laughs> See, you knew you shouldn't have called me because you starting shit. <laughs> <laughs> oh, my God. Jiggly Trucker said the mama going to get the first seat. If he don't know what he talking about, if he got to ass, she taking that front seat. She probably she taking, that, egg. She taking her ass home. Like, yeah, take me home, nigga. Mm-hmm. <laughs> mm-hmm. Goddamn uh, right. Uh, thank you, Jiggly Trucker. Moving on. Ladies, quick question. If I pull it up in my car to pick up you and my mom, who gets that front seat? You or my mom? Who gets that front seat, Q? The mom. Why? Just respect. Mm. 
So you said mom. You said moms would get it. But what if y'all two married though? The mom can still have it. It ain't that serious. I got you all the time. Damn, your mom the one to ride put her in the front seat. <laughs> Oh man, this is this is fucking awesome. All the ladies I talked to so far, they saying that mom's getting that front seat. Thank you, Q4 Trucker. We gotta catch up. All right. All right. Love you. Uh, okay, love. Love you back, baby. Be safe. You too now. Well, there you have it. There you have it. There it is. Nine, uh, ten, nine out of ten women said that the mom's going to get that front seat. Out of, some say out of respect. Some even hinted that if they have to give it to the moms, then, yeah, they might want to be taken home. I don't know. But let's get the conversation started in the comments below. So who gets that front seat? You or your moms. That's what's going on. That's what's up. Hey, I appreciate all you guys listening. Thank you very much for making the Lockout Man podcast show one of your favorite podcasts. Because you know the best conversation starts over here on the Lockout Man podcast show. Until next time, everybody. Y'all stay safe out there and stay tuned for the next one. Peace.